Well, one tornado has touched down today already, and we're not out of the woods yet when it comes to severe weather. Thanks for joining us. I'm Malcolm Adams. Wayne County, Indiana emergency officials also took action, issuing a level one travel advisory for county roads. Some areas are just covered in water. You're advised to take detours. Do not drive through the water. Almost a mile stretch of Boundary Road was underwater as well. The road is closed from Sceny Road to Overman. Portions of Bachhofer and State Line South were blocked due to high water. Now the travel advisory should be lifted by tomorrow afternoon around four. Family, friends and the community of Germantown are mourning the loss of a fallen hero tonight. Corporal Adam Jones. Jones was a Marine killed in a line of duty in Afghanistan. ABC 22's Jackie Kutcher joins us live with a story. Jackie. Thanks, Jackie. Dayton police arrest a man in connection with a fatal shooting that happened earlier this month. Marcus Holland is accused of killing 26 year old Shawan Dorsey and shooting 20 year old David Fantz. The shooting happened on Rugby Avenue April 6th. Holland is charged with murder and felonious assault. Police say more people may have been involved with the crime. The White House is hoping they put an issue at rest that has dogged the president for over two years. President Obama's birth certificate was posted on the White House's website this morning. The so-called birthers, which include Donald Trump, had doubted whether the president was born in the United States. Calling the issue a distraction, the president sent his personal attorney to Hawaii to retrieve the document that shows he was in fact born August 4th, 1961 in Honolulu.